Okay, so yesterday I recorded like a 10 minute vlog and I didn't actually remember to um, unmute my mic. So that's cool. Um, I was rambling for like 10 minutes and waste, waste of time really. I had that video up for like 15 minutes before my brother texted me saying, Hey, um, I don't know if it's me or your video, but I can't hear anything. It was a video. It was a video. Thank you, Killer5362. Like and subscribe to his channel. Um, so I thought I would instead just repeat everything I said yesterday. Because what I tried to do this morning, I tried to be slick, right? And I tried to create a, uh, I tried to create a, a short, like I've been doing. I appreciate all the new followers I've gotten since I've been uploading uh, shorts from the dog park. Um, and I thought I would kind of address the video yesterday and summarize it in a 60 second YouTube short. And then I did it and I recorded it and then I uploaded it and, um, I uploaded the video and I titled it idiot vlogger because I'm an idiot and forgot to unmute my mic. So I think the word idiot in the title, um, triggered the YouTube algorithm bots and then demonetized the video. And we're now eight hours later. Eight hours? It feels like it. Um, I uploaded it at like nine. And it's now 3.45. I'm not doing the math. But uh, we're now this much later. And uh, YouTube still has not given a manual review to my 60 second video. Uh, so I'll just re-record it. Fuck. God, hopefully that word doesn't like demonetize this too. Um, so I'm going to be real. The reason I started uploading videos again is because I kind of remembered that this channel was monetized. Um, I never really made any money on this channel. Uh, I haven't done that because um, back in the day when I was still doing Scam Likely videos, I wasn't eligible for monetization until after the initial um, wave. Until my 15 minutes of fame were up. Then after that, I was eligible for monetization. So those videos that I have with like, you know, the one with like 1.4 million views and the one with like 200,000 views, those I don't make any money off of. And I don't really make any money, period, because like I make like seven cents a month normally and you can't redeem until you get like a $100. Um, but I don't know. I thought that was cool. And then I uploaded uh, a video from the dog park, a little 60 second video of like, night and sassy running around and then uh that got like two thousand views in like two hours and it made 39 cents and i thought hey that's pretty cool so um i wasn't even thinking about monetization when i uploaded that video because i kind of just like i said it before this is like a blocking channel i don't do gaming stuff here because that's not what people want from this channel and i don't do dog suit videos because that's just not what i want to do anymore even though I have some ideas, but I can't upload those dog suit video ideas as funny as I think they would be because it's just going to fuck up the algorithm and I don't want more people to follow. Um, well, I don't want to put in work to make a video and then have people follow just to get disappointed again, like everything that happened the last time I tried that. But um, part of a vlog, I, just, I take the dogs to the dog park every day. Um, we were there for about an hour, sometimes an hour and a half, depending on the weather, depending on how many dogs are there. And I just kind of wanted to share a little slice of my day. And so I'm glad that you guys have been enjoying my videos. I plan to, I plan to continue doing it. Um, I also want to say that, like, if you think that, like, some of the quality or like, some of the angles from the camera are bad, that's intentional because um, even though it's, like, a public park, uh, I see the same people every day. And they never told me that I can't record the dogs, but out of courtesy, I don't want to record them. So I try and, like angle things to get as few people in the shot as possible, you know? Anyway, speaking about dogs, um... Dogs. Hi, dogs. Hey, Sassy. You wanna come say hi? I don't know if I've ever, like, formally introduced Sassy on this channel. Um... So... OG viewers... Look at all this fur. Look at all this fur, man. So... It's hard to tell. It's so thin, but there's a lot of it. OG viewers uh, know Leona. Um, she passed away last year. I made a video about that. I made two videos about that, actually. And then um, there's Knight. He's sleepy. He's a sleepy old man. So um, 
Leona passed, and then I was not really ready to get another dog for, for a few months, and I didn't know when I would be, but we could tell that night was getting lonely, so um, we looked into a husky rescue. Sassy, she is... We've had her for a year now, so she's three. She's a Pomsky. Pomeranian husky mix. Uh, you might notice her eye looks a little messed up, and like, yeah, it does, and that's because she wasn't very taken... well taken care of uh, by her last owner. And she had a really bad infection in her eye, and she had a bunch of infected rotting teeth. And we've pulled the teeth out, and her eye, we've treated it. Um, it's not infected anymore, but, like, there's just so much damage to it that just... She can see out of it. It doesn't hurt her. It's not causing any more problems. It just looks really messed up. But it still works, and it doesn't cause her any pain, so that's it. She just she just has a nasty-looking eye. It's her, uh, her dead eye. Dead-eye sarsaparilla. Um, she's a good dog. She's a good dog. Knight's a good boy, too. He's always a good boy. Yeah. Yes, you are, bud. So, that's sassy. Uh, she likes the dog park. Knight likes the dog park. I like the dog park. A lot of fun all around, so I'm glad you guys are enjoying the videos. I plan to continue doing it until somebody gives me a problem at the dog park. And if nobody does, then I'll just keep doing it. I also think I'll just keep doing vlogs, too. Um... It's actually had a few people message me yesterday saying that the audio was non-existent, which tells me that there are people actually interested in hearing from me. So that's good. Um, the reason I wanted to make a video in the first place yesterday is because it just like dawned on me that I only ever make videos whenever I'm, whenever I'm, whenever I'm, I'm going through it. You know, whenever, whenever I'm going through it emotionally or I'm stuck in my own head or things aren't going that well. Um, that's when I make a video because it just, it's kind of like therapy for me to just kind of talk it out to avoid. I know some of you guys personally who watch my channel, but, um, out of the, uh, 1300 something subscribers that I have, I don't know the vast majority of you. So like, it's easy to just kind of like speak into the void and say my feelings out there because sometimes you just want to tell people what's, what you're, what, what's, what you're going through, right? What's going on. But you don't really want to tell people that you know, because if you tell people that you know, um, that might just be something that you might not want people in your life to know. And um, I don't think I've said anything on my channel that I wouldn't tell someone I know, but I'm just not always in the mood to tell people what I'm going through, you know? Nothing against people I know, nothing against me, nothing serious about it, you know? Just, that's how it is. So, yesterday I just wanted to talk about how good things are going, actually. Um... Today, one of the, one of the good things I'm going through, in fact, like the 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 major good thing I'm going through, aside from the fact that like my kid, who like I don't want to talk too much about her because like the privacy reasons, I guess. But my kid, who I don't ever plan on showing on camera until she's like older, older. Um, she's like a, she's a toddler. She's she's starting to say more words now, and I love it. She's entering that phase where everything is wow. And entering that phase where she can say some words incorrectly. And the ones she's really good at are no and shoe. Those are the words she's really good at. And I love watching her grow. And being a dad is the best thing that ever happened to me. Uh, I enjoy and I love every day. And everything I do, I do for her. Except for the one thing I do for me, which now is Ariel Silks. So... Um, Ariel Silks, for those who don't know, is like, why is my camera getting fuzzy? Hang on, watch this. I just made it worse. Farts. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, wait, wait, I just made it worse. Shoot, I did, I did, hang on. What just came off? Oh, that was a food thing, okay. Anyways, I think I made it better. So, Ariel Silks is, um, it's, it's that, uh, it's that circus thing where, like, um, that circus thing like like Cirque du Soleil, uh La Nuba. Um a lot of a lot of shows have it where like the, the the curtains, the long silk curtains that hang from the ceiling and people will climb them and wrap themselves up and do flips and drops and stuff. I'm learning how to do that. I've been wanting to do that since I was 18, but for a long time I thought like for like, for like most of most of my adult life I'm like when would I ever use this? Why would I want to do this? Like it looks really cool, but like 
is it is it like a realistic thing it's super stuff super specialized and niche and you don't really want to be in a circus do you and i just kind of let it go and then uh, a couple years back um a friend from out of state took me to the uh pirate dinner show in my town in my city and there was a guy doing aerial silks and he looked like me which is not something i'd seen before because every time i've seen aerial silks um it's always like a super tall guy with like a massive wingspan who's like who's like very fit doing it but like he had my body shape you know and it's incredible because i never seen anyone do that and i thought if this dude can do it i can do it and then i got in my own head and i got scared and i thought well i'm really out of shape i probably shouldn't um it's gonna be too hard for me and i just kind of like gave up on that and then um earlier this month went to halloween horror nights and they don't do the bill and ted excellent adventure show there anymore they do um they they have they, they contract like they contract like smaller acts to to do their show and this year they contracted um nightmare fuel nightmare fuel good show pyrotechnics spinning blades acrobatics uh magic it's all very cool and there was a guy doing uh there was a guy who i affectionately call spooky ken who was doing something similar it wasn't exactly that but like they were long ropes from the ceiling and they were like hand straps he had his hands in and he was doing very similar things and he was even doing it with a partner and like he's like throwing her in the air and catching her with his like legs and shit absolutely incredible i want to like i saw that i'm like i want to be spooky ken i want to be that guy and how long do i want to let my dreams just be dreams so on the way home from halloween horror nights I looked up the I looked up for any gyms in my area, and I found one, and they have reasonable prices or classes. So I I signed up the next day, and I've been going once a week for this week and the two weeks before this week, and starting next week I am doing two classes a week, and I'm having I'm having so much fun. I feel look at this shit. Look at this shit. It's so much. Fun. I'm having I'm having the time of my life, man. I feel young again. I feel inspired. I feel energized. I mean, like right now, I'm actually like really, really tired because I am still out of shape. Um, I can't support my body weight that well. And everyone else who's in that class is a chick who is like three percent body fat. And I know they've been doing it for years, which is why they're like really good. And and I'm sure they take better care of themselves than than, than I do too. But like. I've I've been kind of a kind of a stocky guy ever since uh, college, and I haven't been in great shape in a long time. I was in great shape um, for about six months, uh, two years ago, and then my in laws passed, and we did a lot of traveling and stress eating, and I lost all my progress and ended up five pounds heavier than where I started. But I've been fasting, and over the last couple of months, I've, yeah, over the last couple of months I've been fasting. I have been eating less candy, drinking less soda. I haven't gone cold turkey. I'm 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 not the master willpower for that kind of thing, but um I'm down fifteen pounds. I started at uh two forty five. This morning I weighed two thirty one point two. And um God wills it, I will be two thirty or less tomorrow. And I'm gonna keep losing weight because I feel like cutting weight is probably gonna make it easier to support my body weight up there. And Monday, I am going back to Planet Fitness to use the treadmills because cardio is really good for cutting weight. And I would rather shoot my best boy in the goddamn face than go running around in Floridian humidity. Okay? You know how much I love him? That's how much I hate going outside. So, I want to go back to Planet Fitness and use the treadmills. And they have an assisted pull bar there because I can't do a single pull up. I have a pull up bar at home, and I've been doing negative pull ups with it, which is like where you like jump up to pull yourself up and slowly lower yourself down, you know? So, hey, bud. Hey, cutie patootie. So, that's where I'm at right now. I'm having the time of my life. I'm enjoying life. I'm happy. And I want you guys to know that. Um,. If you guys want me to do more more vlogs, I will. If you don't, I won't. Let me know in the comments. Um, and, okay, I guess another thing. 
for those of you guys, for the for the, like the 18 of you who popped up from the shorts I've been uploading, if you guys have made it all the way to the end of this video, would you guys be cool with like shorts it, or vlogs in the form of shorts? Or do you guys just want dog stuff? Because like, I don't know. I think I overthink. No, I definitely overthink too much, you know? But I don't know. I'm happy. And thanks for watching the video. And I'll catch you guys later. Say bye, Knight. Say bye. All right.